up? What's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? It's your boy Kevin to turn on this motherfucking YouTube shit. What's up? 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 It's your boy. Can't you tell me this shit? Hey man, say man, we are lit, eh? Man, throw my fucking teeth, man. Turn, 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 turn. Yeah. So what's up? Let's stay hood now, sauce. Scripture, man. Hey man, say man, come to you as a Hebrew is like as a Jew, man. Hey man, we turn, 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 turn. Hey man, we turn in the hood. Make sure y'all like and subscribe these videos up, man. We turn, 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 Lydia three titties, man. We doing some legal teams right now, man, but we out, we out here for the one time, one time, man. If y'all remember last time, they called the popo, but we good. Hey, man, say, man, um, we been talking about, um, Boosie, man. Boosie, man. You know, Boosie been going all crazy with, um, over T.I. and shit, because, you know, rat and shit. T.I. and Boosie supposed to be having a, a damn, um, a motherfucking album coming out. And we ain't gonna never be able to hear no more, because T.I. dumb big mouth, blabbed his mouth 24-7. So that shit is dead, alright? So that's not, that's, not the, that's not what we've been talking about. But we've been talking about, um, Boosie. Boosie, man. Boosie daughter. Poison Ivy, man. So if y'all did not know, um, Boosie daughter, Poison Ivy, um, she came out, man. She came out as, that she liked lesbians. That she liked girls. I thought she was bi. You know what I'm saying? I thought she had a chance, but she said she's lesbian. So, you know what I'm saying? We let her do what she want to do. So, yeah. So, it, um, Boosie was on the interview talking about, um, how Poison Ivy was just, man, Poison Ivy crazy, man, Poison Ivy, she was like, she was like, yeah, man, ain't nobody in our family gay, ain't nobody gay, you know what I'm saying, everybody in our family got that, that strong southern baptism, you know what I'm saying, church going, you know what I'm saying, type of family, you feel me, like, nobody's gay like that, you feel me, like, and he was like, he was like, he was basically saying, like, damn, like, and, and he was like, did you, did you know that she was gay, he like, nah, I ain't really know that she was gay, because, you know what I'm saying? She had a she had a boyfriend. She, she, that's what he's saying. She had a boyfriend coming to her um coming to the crib, which is crazy. You know, most parents don't even have motherfucking boyfriend and girlfriends come over to the nigga crib because you know they automatically think they gonna get pregnant. But yeah, so she like yeah, nah, man, um, um, yeah. She she had a boyfriend come over, but he said nah, now nah, think about it, she he might have been gay. <laughs> her boyfriend might have been gay. He might have been just been her friend or some shit. That's what he's saying. And shit, and he like. Bro, I thought, I thought Poison Ivy was 18. She 22. She a grown ass woman. She can do whatever the fuck she want to. That's what they were saying. They're like, man. They're like, at the end of the day, man. They said, like, they said, like, did you, did you, ask, did you ask, did she, did she, did she tell you that she, that she like females? She gonna come out gay? After, on this whole stand she was talking about? She's like, nah. He's like, I found out just like you found out by the internet. <laughs> Cause he's like, he's like, um. His children don't really talk to him about relationships and shit. You know, parents be on some extra shit sometimes. So you don't really tell them everything you, you're going through. Especially Boosie. You know what I'm saying? Boosie already said, man, that shit is wrong. Transgender shit is wrong. You know what I'm saying? Especially as a little kid, wrong. You know what I'm saying? So, But Boosie, he kind of doubled down and he didn't double down. He doubled down on saying like, yeah, our family is real strong baptism. For the next people, it's not okay. But for his daughter, he's like, he gonna let it go with shit. But you know what I'm saying? He was like, man, he's like, you can't really tell her what to do, man. You can't really tell her what to do because, man, she's a grown-ass female. She's 22. How you gonna tell her that she can't talk to who, she can't do this and do that? You feel me? Like, we all living life, and at the end of the day, man, people gonna do what they wanna do and shit, man. Like, that's like, she got her own crib. She got her own spot. She making her own money. You know what I'm saying? At the end of the day, Boosie can't do shit. Boosie, Boosie said he's the head of the household, but at the end of the day, man, she grown. She doing. It. She moved on. She moved to a different, a different spot. She got a whole girlfriend and shit. But it's crazy because I thought I thought Boosie knew a little, a little bit of something. That's why he was. I thought that's why he was getting on the, at them people. No, he was just mad. Get on, just get on him. He didn't even know his. He didn't even know his daughter was foo foo. You know what I'm saying? On some shit like that. Until um, until she um, until she told until she told everybody. He like. I mean, he like. Damn. I just got this motherfucking nigga head about the shit. But now they on some extra shit. I gotta see who this is. This is not the fans or whoever it is. But yeah, man. So he's like, man, I ain't got on their head and shit. And after this, you just told me that you gay too? Man, come on, man. How can this be? You know what I'm saying? But but you know what I'm saying? At the end of the day, she, she, gonna, she gonna like who she like. She's still young. She's 22, so she might turn back into like the boys. I mean, if she like girls for the rest of her life, that's her. I mean, that's she can if she want to. That's her. 
You feel me? So, so yes, man. So they was asking basically like, damn, how did you not know that your, that, that she was that she was wasn't gay? And you go on this whole stand. He's like, I didn't even know. So it's like, damn. I guess we all found out at the same time. Boosty found out. I found out. Black found out. Everybody found out that she was awesome. Like, you know, like she like females. But yeah, man, that's her. You know what I'm saying? That she living up to get life. All right, boom. That's that's that situation. Boom. That's skirt. 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 All right, man. So we now we're gonna talk about the gunner situation, man. Gunner, man. Okay, Boosie got on gunner head, bro. I think gunner might be a bigger rat than six nine. You know, six nine was a big rat. That was a big, 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 big rat. Nigga got on the court, point that. That's the dude. That's the dude. That's the dude. And that's the other dude. Nigga bratted, ratted. But you know, he was facing life though. This nigga was facing life. You feel me? Ain't no, no excuse for him for ratting and shit. But this nigga was facing life. <laughs> you dig what I'm saying? And he, was, and he was fucking this bitch and kidnapped him. Gunna, gonna live, gonna live in a life. Gunna, gonna, gonna, a millionaire. He rich. He's, he's, thug a second hand man. He's only gonna be in the fucking pokey for five fucking years. And then funky ass shit will only be the whole years, bro. It's gonna be two years, man. Two, three years. And that's what basically Boosie was saying the thing too, man. He was like, man, you wanna live after the whole fucking years, nigga. You ain't gonna get out in less, like two years, nigga. Like, what the fuck is we doing, bro? You know what I'm saying? He basically Boosie was like, man, that nigga rat rat, nigga. Ain't no way. Ain't no way he's just rat it. He's like, it's just not good, man. It's like, damn, the, the people, the people. The people told that you ratted, and you got released. Now you a bigger rat. Like the fuck, nigga, you don't, you know, released to be the rat. Like fuck, nigga, you. How do you think that life is gonna be any type of sweeter? That it, that you feel like any type of rapper is gonna like fuck with you, like on some, like you know, what I'm saying on some shit like that. You know, on some making music type shit. You feel me? Cause that's like that's some that's some next level rat shit. You know what I'm saying? Nigga, I took down the whole fucking YSL thugger. Is it? He said, Gunner is YSL the game. Yes, ma'am. Oh, like that. Come on, man. You didn't have to say yes, ma'am, like that, bro. You could have said no, ma'am. I mean, no. Do what it did. Do what it do, man. So it's like, Boosie really hurt, man, because he's like, man, Boosie's like, man, how can you just be spratting on everybody, bro? And your time, nigga, you wasn't even gonna be, you wasn't even gonna be in the motherfucking thing for that long, man. You were just gonna be in the motherfucking cell for at least about two years, bro. Ain't no man, like, you ratted, he was basically, like, basically saying, you ratted for no reason, nigga. <laughs> you dead if you do, dead if you don't, nigga. Why the fuck would you rat, nigga? And you thought, and you think shit was gonna be sweet, that when you get back outside, it's still YSL label, Free Thugger. The fuck, nigga, you just snitched on the whole label. How is it still YSL the label? You know what I'm saying? Weird shit. He did, so they like, so they basically was trying to see, wait, on, wait, wait, wait on Thugger to see what he gonna do, man. If he gonna, if he gonna say it's, it's okay for Gunner to make music and he still is part of the gang, which they said ain't nobody in that bitch um supposed to be snitching. So whoever's in the plea deal, Thugger brother, Thugger um Thugger brother, Thugger, I mean, Thugger brother and um Gunner and the rest of the people y'all gone. But good news, man, the people who actually did the. Th- did the, the, the doing the niggas they they didn't they didn't snitch you know what I'm saying they held they holding it down so them niggas might be in that, in that time for a little bit minute but you know some of the niggas already got a, a, a life a life sentence already so they just doubling life sentences <laughs> they just saying who no cars at this point <laughs> doubling the deck shuffling the deck up and shit playing spades and shit so yeah so Boosie was like man gonna act none of these motherfucking rappers in a whole motherfucking label finna do no song with you. You ain't finna have no features. The only, if you do have a feature, no names, nigga. And them niggas who do the features probably ain't gonna never get no people to do some them. You know, so it's like, I'm like, bruh, why would you leave the bitch with a bad bitch? A builder bitch. Wow, shit, nigga, this nigga left with a builder bitch. Wow, shit, nigga. And you know what I'm saying? The shit is crazy, cause nigga, if you was to stay them two years, nigga, you know how to, you know how golden you would've been? Nigga, you know how much golden you would've been gonna if you would've just stayed them two years, bro? They would've said, dang, why is still still in this bitch, nigga? You would've got that bitch? Nigga would've probably been in that bitch a little bit longer, but like, damn, they would've been like, damn, yeah, real one, real one, yes, sir. You want you to go to the label? Nigga, why the fuck would you take a plea to your thing? They would not gonna release your fucking statement or your audio you saying, what, or the video you saying, yes, ma'am. Like, what are we doing? Nigga ain't never been to prison before, and that's what Gunner, that's what Base Boost was saying, man. He was like, man, 
That nigga ain't never been in this shit, man. You could tell that nigga was gonna buy the snitch and shit, man. But he's like, he's like, he's like, he's like, man, when you when you thug a man, cause he know Boosie be in that position. He's like, when you thug a man, you just wanna make that money, man. You just trying to get that money at, at all costs. And you you see this nigga right here, he can rap hella good. The mic turn on fucking fire, ice, and everything, lightning when this nigga rap. But this nigga just a pussy ass, snitch ass, rat ass nigga, man. So it's like, damn, this nigga already fucked, man. So, hey, man, make sure you like subscribe to this video, man. That was just like uh, my take on the uh, Boosie daughter coming out and Boosie saying on uh, Gunna, which I, I, I agree on both of them. Now it's like, not, not trying to dig around nothing, but you know what I'm saying? I agree with the nigga. Like, nigga, if a female or your kid is gay, man, make the niggas wait till they're 20 or uh, 18. She waited till she was 21. 22. Um, Gunner, you a rat, so, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Hey, make sure you like a Scotty video, man. We out this bitch, man, hood and outside crib shit. Free that nigga thug, man. We out this bitch, hood and outside. We'll try, we try to get some more videos coming out, man. Stay patient with your boy. We out this bitch, hood and outside. Make sure the 12 ain't coming for your boy. I gotta make sure 12 ain't coming. Alright, you do some head ass. And I'm sorry. You just Hey, Dad, you know what I want. We need to talk about this shit. Be legendary. You know this is instrumental. You the instrumental. So, pull that everywhere.